So something a little different this evening. We are going to go and make Russian dumplings. That's right. I am so excited because I love dumplings of all varieties. <laughs> um, so they look, from what I've seen, look like um, sort of Asian dumplings. But I think they are slightly different. I think they might be a little bit more indulgent. I'm not sure. So thank you so much to Ella for tonight's opportunity making the Russian dumplings and to Love Top Ups London. We do really appreciate it and we can't wait to get going. Let's do this. Colour, colourful one. There you go. Nice. <laughs> Just a little bit about myself. So I'm Ala. I'm, I started my food blog about six years ago. Before that, I was actually working in recruitment as a consultant mm -hmm. and done all the other jobs possible. Um, and I sort of saw a niche in Russian and East European food. That's why, like, obviously, we're going to be doing a Russian cooking class today. The fried ones with cheese, they're like so good, very addictive, and they're, they're traditional with meat filling. You'll be actually doing everything yourself, so it's a hands-on class, so you'll be making the dough from scratch, you'll be rolling it out, I might take the dough just to show you how to make the dumpling, <laughs> and then you'll be putting the filling in, and in the end, uh, I'm going to boil them and fry them, we're going to sit down and we're going to have pretty much uh, a dinner afterwards, so you'll be eating your hard work. So you always work with the back of your palm, okay, so you press inside and you kind of just fold it from both sides and you want to achieve quite an elastic dough so it doesn't stick. Put some caramelized onions, so I've just sorted the onion on a frying pan. Actually smell it, I don't know if you can smell it from here, but the caramelized onion already gives it like a really nice smell. To roll it out, you want to press right in the middle, so you don't just do this, you kind of press your palms here. The circle doesn't need to be perfect, it doesn't really need to be anything. You take your cup and all you do, just press really hard and roll. Just clip it at first on top and then go at the bottom and then stretch and fold. Like that? Yeah. Yeah? Perfect. So you just, yeah, this is good. My first ever dumpling. Proud of that. Well, we've only got one cheese, and that's okay. Finished? Done. Good to know. Cheese. I'm just going to add some oil. So it's going to be like sort of deep fried, not too little oil, but like enough to cover the pan. So they're like very, they're going to be very naughty, but you know, that's what it is. Really hot. Too hot. Too hot. Your weight. Let me say. <laughs> yeah. Let me say. So good. Cheesy. Cheesy deliciousness.